All right, hey guys. So I'm just gonna real quick show you my outfit. I showered today. I'm just trying every day to maintain a bit of normalcy for me. So um, the normalcy for me is showering and getting dressed. If I stay in like the same old pajamas, I just feel like I'm gonna get lost in like a twilight zone. Um, I really don't force the kids to get dressed if they don't want to, um, besides like clean pajamas. Like if you want to wear pajamas today, that's fine, but it has to be clean. Like every day we do put on clean clothes. Um, and their bath routine is still the same every other night as needed. Violet is typically every night because she's a mess. But yeah, so real quick, I'll flip around and show so you. please don't mind the hot mess express that is my bedroom. But this is one of my favorite shirts. It says Mama of Monsters. It's actually a Halloween shirt. Obviously, it's orange. I had it made by uh, a friend that I used to work with, Jamie. Um, she has a, like a company for that, and so she made it for me, and I'm obsessed. So I'm just wearing that in some track pants today. Definitely low-key comfy. Leave my house, so doesn't matter if I'm wearing track pants. No, if I was leaving my house, we definitely wouldn't be in track pants. So, so the house is definitely a little crazier today. We weren't able to really maintain any of our schedule. I hurt my neck pretty bad yesterday. I don't know, probably stress-related, but. Um, taking the dogs out so I haven't been moving much um, today I'm definitely like up and mobile so I'm gonna do laundry and stuff but my nephew came with Ryler yesterday when he got home so my nephew is 10 he's been here helping with the kids and stuff so um, we're just gonna let them have some chill time Corey's also home like you see in my last vlog so he's been playing some video games I know he has to run out and get supplies so that'll happen but um, I think I'm just gonna show you guys when I'm whipping them up for lunch which I think is grilled cheese for the masses and then I am going to be making a cucumber sandwich for me. I requested to help some cucumber, yes. Don't bite it. It's gonna go on mommy's sandwich. Look. We need the butter for it. Can you get me the purple one? Purple. Hey friends, same day. So lunch is over now, which the kids all ate it all, so perfect. And Bai is just waking up from her nap, so if you can hear that. So we're gonna go get her, and then I'm going to fold laundry because hashtag story of my life. Whew. Okay, so here's Bai. Did you take your picture off the wall? How come? Yeah, you took it off. Here, we'll fix it. There's nothing she could have got hurt on. It's just like a, almost like a plywood thing I painted before I had the cricket. A poopy. Your poopy? Boop. Okay, let's change our poop. Hey friends, so it's the afternoon here now, just past five nap time. Um, Mikey's currently sleeping in my bed because he was Ah, crying literally about everything and I was like you need to come lay down so I laid beside him for about 20 minutes um, and he was crying and we called Corey because he was crying for Corey because Corey ran out like I said earlier to get supplies and um, 
yeah he was really upset and so Corey talked to him for a minute once he realized Corey was also not happy with like the way he was behaving he continued to cry in a little ball and literally fell asleep like oh it was so sad and cute so then he slept there and I just chilled with him for a bit and then came up because I could hear Vi woke up um, so we came and got Violet and now she's having a little quick bath because take advantage of being home during the day so you don't have to do it at night yeah she's so cute so we'll flip around I'll show you and I think she has her hair brush still so what do you have? Uh, oh. oh. She was crying there. Um, so that, that's why her face is like. I'll get him, I'll get him. Sweet little baby. Yeah, you can have some of that water right there, buddy. I can smell water. What? Don't let me eat it. Well, for Why? Don't for Charlie. Don't for Charlie. Hey friends, another day, same shirt, obviously I slept in it, we haven't gotten ready yet, it is late in the morning here, um, it is a crap day out, Vi is reading me a book, um, so that's nice, and I'm just waiting for all the boys to wake up because they had a quarantine fun last night, just excited to have dad home I think, quack quack quack, so me and Vi are reading, slash Vi's reading to me, and we're just gonna Yay. chill, and then I'll give you some insight on our day at home with the schedule later on. Hey friends, so the rest of the family is finally awake. Violet is following me upstairs. Um, so it's a little after 10, which if you can believe that is a crazy sleep in. I think everyone was up by like 9.45, so um, they're just chilling having breakfast. I told them no tablets this morning or anything until quiet time, so they're pretty frustrated considering yesterday was a free day. Um, so we're just gonna allow them chill. I'm gonna shower and get ready, like I said, maintain my normalcy for the day. We're gonna get Vi dressed now that everyone's kind of up and moving, and then start school. Stay tuned. Hey friends, so fresh from the shower, got my outfit on, wife life, mom life, best life, and some Batman pants. Same messy room, because obviously I haven't cleaned it yet, my bed is even falling, the sheet's falling off. We're unfiltered here, guys. I ain't gonna clean nothing for you first. Ain't nobody got time for that. Hey, huh? Did your baby do in the light? Oh, careful. Yeah. All right, guys, so we're gonna start school in like 10 minutes, okay? No. How are you feeling about it today? Okay, guys, so as I've been planning school, I've noticed that the workbooks I kept downstairs for them and like the other ones I packed away weren't it just doesn't have everything Rye's gonna need. So I'm going to have to go back upstairs through their books. So I'll show you guys a brief clip of that. But real quick, let's check out what'll be Vi's like third snack and their second snack. Rye's coming. You know, lucky charms for the win, guys. They're the best because their cousin was over yesterday, but I keep all their like immediate coloring books, schoolwork that they've just brought home and stuff. This is where they keep it until I put it in. Um, if you follow me on Facebook, I have cardboard boxes that I keep in our cubby of all their artwork. I've never really thrown away anything. So I'm going to go through here. As you can see, here's one of their books. There's another one on the floor. Um, and one of my vlog or blog posts before I wrote about how I picked up a bunch of these workbooks before, um, to do like after school and stuff. So yeah, we'll get those all out. Stay tuned. <laughs> Here's my stack of phonics. I grabbed out some coloring books from up there, but my mother-in-law actually sent this super awesome goodie bag with some puzzles. Um, so I'll this show is like you. a brief overview, obviously, but like there's construction paper, coloring books, um, game cards, uh, matching game puzzles. So that'll all just like keep 
keep them busy also so that's awesome i'm trying to figure out a way to organize all this i think that will obviously be in the but i can't wait to show you guys when i do finally organize it all my little homeschool haul secretly this is dreams because i've told a million people me and corey can finally like buy a house this place where we rent won't let us um our lease states like you can't do home care but i would love to do home care and keep these little bums home all day Love it. I'll be honest guys, the worst part is that literally I feel like I'm cleaning my full house every day. Um, but the kids are all saying, ew, I just gotta whip around and show them. It's been pouring all morning and it literally just went to sleep. And here is all our baking stuff. It has had to be locked up now. Obviously, Corey cannot handle by coming in here, but it's also a stash. I need to buy a pair of four crayons, a little eraser because she wanted it, and there we go. She's gonna color. So the table is clean and we are going to do some more books. Yeah, come on. It has been a week where I cannot remember what day it is. Often I'm like, Alexa, what day is it? Mommy, and usually she'll tell me to have a good day, which helps because oh, they test me oh, as much as I'm like, I love it, dreams. I do, but they test me a lot, but they're doing so good. So Violet's outfit of the day is very cozy, track pants, and I'm going to take the dogs out. Since Mama's got to eat too, I'm going to make a bagel while they work and Vi runs around. It's the cereal ride in the day. I'm not joking when I say this place is a wild habitat, guys, I'm not. Real quick, I have had a lot of questions about the chore chart. Um, it's something I created on the Cricut, there's a magnet sheet. Are you sticking it to the fridge? So these are, this is their chore chart. Um, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Um, here we And yeah, so Vi loves the magnets and they're dual purpose for that reason. Um, so the Saturday and Sunday ones are pink, so they're going to be more time consuming, obviously. It's like cleaning their room, putting their toys away, things like that. Hang on. Okay, cool. Violet loves magnets. Um, and then these ones are here. And so the kids will get to pick, like, what they do. I think this one fell off from last night. Um, so this is just, like, helping collect garbage, helping collect dishes. Um, and then if they do that for the full week, then they get, like, a treat or, like, their movie night or a snack or something that was extra. This really cool... I wash my hands pencil that actually changes color the longer you hold it. I think just to like really sink in that like what you touch matters. Working on the letter B, rise tracing some words. You can imagine it's probably been about 20 minutes since I said I was gonna make a bagel and I still haven't, so. Mom life, hashtag quarantine life. Oh yeah, and she's ice cold coffee in case you're wondering that too. No delicacies in this house. Rye actually came in at grade one um, a little behind most of his peers in English school because he was trying and learning so much in French that he really didn't understand French or English coming in. You have them all. Pick them up. And so he's so proud right now. I'm just going to flip around and show you. He just spelled ant and bat all on his own, like sounding it out, which I know is like... Man, another short day. It's just amazing to really see how far he's come since November, when prior to November he really couldn't like sound out or like, he would ask me like, mommy, how do you spell this? And I would try to help him. And it just wasn't as easy as it, it should have been, you know what I mean? He should be able to be like, oh, right, like that's B-A-T, and he could write B-A-T. But he literally didn't know that B was a B because that's the French words. Oh and fat and man, these are all his short A sounds that he picked to write. And of course, he's like my mother and he writes in all capitals. Yeah, so we're going to finish the rest of this page. And then Rai's actually done crushed his um, stuff today. No. Cat. Cat. Mommy, 
bad cat. And yes, you're right. Hello. So yeah. Nana had buddy. She wants you to sit with her, but the chair's not big enough. Are you two sitting together? Yeah, I can stay. Good job, oh, Mikey. Yeah. Mommy, and Are you doing your work? All right, hey friends. Um, we're going into the afternoon now. Five's just having a little ramen in pairs. Corey, we never buy ramen. Corey just picks them up, and I'm so excited. I love ramen. We never buy it. So Vi's loving it. The boys just finished a game of Snake and Ladders, which actually went pretty well. And now they're going upstairs to play Lego. Um, they're hoping to earn back some tablet time today, but they got a little silly during book work, so we'll see. We will see. Um, Corey had to run out um, to go rifle, but uh, hopefully he wants to come home and do the dishes for me. He doesn't watch these vlogs, but if he did, I would pray to him. <laughs> Alright friends, so Vi's done her lunch. She's just gotten up to bed now. The boys have actually agreed to do Legos for quite time, so they're living the no tablet life and accepting it finally. <laughs> and I'm just gonna give you a brief look at like, I'm on basket three of six folding because you know, I'm blessed with all the family members. Oh God, so I'm gonna fold a million baskets of laundry and then the plan is maybe to clean my room. So big adult goals for quiet time today. Um, I think I'm just gonna end the video here today. Um, there's not much going on this afternoon. I think I'm gonna let the boys kind of do some guy stuff with Corey downstairs, maybe build something. So we'll see definitely what happens, but beyond that, it's been a pretty chill day. It is literally almost quarter to one, so if you can imagine how late the day's kind of been pushed, um, considering Vi's usually in bed before, like at noon. So a little bit later today, but yeah, just gonna take it easy, enjoy, and I gotta take chicken out for dinner, so. See y'all in another vlog.